Hey, what's going on everybody? Chris from Motorsports International in Arm, Massachusetts, outside in the parking lot on a nice, beautiful morning. I want to cover some of the new sports side-by-sides that came out this year. We're going to start with the Polaris, the guys that started it from the beginning, the XP1000. Now, this will come with 110 horsepower stock, 16 inches of suspension travel in the front, 18 in the rear at a 64-inch stance. You have a 200 and about 300-pound cargo capacity with a nine and a half gallon gas tank so gas tanks pretty good size you can get a good you know good ride out of it stock comes with maxis bighorn 29 inch tires they've been using these tires for a while people love them they work great all round so you know that's what they've been running everyone else runs them on theirs as well so moving on to the honda talon i have one of these i race it i love it so give a quick rundown on this also comes with Maxxis tires, but these are designed specifically for the Honda Talon. You cannot buy these anywhere but Honda. These are 28 inch tires, a little bit smaller than the 29s, but they're designed to work with this machine. This will not have a CVT belt. It is a DCT transmission. You can either paddle shift it or you can put it in automatic mode or automatic sport, get a little bit of faster shift times. 14 and a half inches of suspension travel in the front, 15 in the rear. So a little bit less than this but it works very well with the platform that it is. One thing they come with that nobody else has factory will be window nets and a roof. The roof is huge. That's usually the first thing that everybody throws on the machine from day one. So they put it in there, which is pretty nice from stock. Overall, they killed it with this. A little bit of a small gas tank. It concerns people at a seven and a half gallon tank, but it holds up pretty well. You know, I run about the same as these guys. It's not revving out like the CVT belt is. It holds its RPM pretty well, so. The next one definitely came out with a swinging from Kawasaki is the new KRX 1000. It's a bigger machine at 68 inches wide. Also has 31 inch tires with Beadlocks factory. Nobody else has done that. So these tires are incredible. Very good reviews on these tires and they come with it stock. 18 inches of suspension travel in the front, 21 inches in the rear. Huge, huge compared to everyone else also comes with a 10 gallon gas tank. So it's a larger gas tank. The weights across all of them, everyone may know that this is about 1900 pounds. That's wet weight. The Polaris is gonna be about 1360, that's dry. Keep that in mind, that's no fluids, nothing. And this runs around 15, that's also wet weight. So this is about 110 horsepower rumored, 104 horsepower, 110. So they're all pretty much in the same playing field. MSRP is very similar within each other. There's a lot of different things that you can go in and out of, but that is the gist of it. This is what is out there. This is top of the line for the market this year. So please stop in and check these out anytime you'd like. Thank you.